So here we have our traditional spring-loaded mousetrap. You can see the yellow paddle um, that is loaded up with peanut butter uh, as bait. Now this is already loaded, so I am going to show you how easy it is to spring a trap with just using my wooden spoon here. I'm just going to gently touch, and there... <laughs> <laughs> the trap spraying. So that's why when you are um, putting your traps out, when you're getting them set, you always want to hold from this side, um, the side that is actually opposite of where the bait is going to be placed. Um, yeah, you'd actually hold from this side where the V is that's going to be opposite of where the bait is placed. So that way if it does spring, you're not going to get hurt. Now the other uh, option that I would recommend is this um, glue trap or uh, yeah it's just a glue board and this is actually the Tomcat brand we've tried these as well this is what it looks like when you buy it they come in a variety of different sizes and all you need to do is unpeel and you can see how hard that is to pull away um, but you're just going to unpeel it completely and then set this trap in the line you know, of the path of where you believe the mice are um, crossing about in your home. So, a couple of different types of options um, for mouse trap. Again, the glue board, this one by Tomcat, and my all-time favorite, you know, if you've got a mouse and you want to get rid of it right away, bait up an old fashioned Victor spring loaded mouse trap with some peanut butter or tie a nut around the end uh, to where the mouse will have to pull out it really hard and you'll catch your mouse in no time flat. Thanks for watching.